Hello, you guys. Welcome to Two Season in the Attic, and welcome to week 41. Yes, this is going up late. I apologize. Uh, the week snuck up on me, and I got some other things that needed to be done first, so I got those done. So if you remember, if you follow my channel at all, I made this beautiful page um, using Confessions of a Paper Attic Cut File. Um, it was part of 30 Days of Sketches. I loved it, and I had pictures left over. I needed to make another layout. So I have this lovely sketch and I have tons of photos which I'm pretty sure I can narrow it down to seven I, there's more than seven but a lot of them are very like very similar poses type thing um so I know I can narrow it down to seven so I'm gonna do that I'm gonna try and keep them close to um the cuts that are on the page and uh, I have only this left over for that Cartabella collection. So my goal is to use this up and I wanted, I needed some more paper. So I went and dug, um, through my other kits that I have to try and find, um, one that like at least color wise would kind of go with it. Oh yeah. And this cardstock came with this and I grabbed, um, well, I found, I found more things that belong to this collection. So I found some ephemera and a cream cardstock that came in that uh kit and then i found was this echo park and since cartabella echo park they're the same company so this is echo park fall fever i figured i would maybe see if there's any papers in here that i could use and this is super cute um this would go good with all the stuff i've been playing with and i haven't touched this one yet have i no. Um, so I was going to play with some of this, maybe add some of that into that. Just so this is the main, so the pages coordinate, um, the, cause they'll be side by side in the album. So I'll use this as well. So let me trim down photos, kind of get some stuff picked out, figure out what I'm using and we'll check back in. All right. So I did a bunch of cutting and assembling off camera, just trying to get this, um, page done for you guys so I've got my photos I gutted gut the cream colored cardstock and then I matted all my photos on that as well um, I just kind of started arranging some things and I did these these ones they're a little bit different to size because I didn't want to trim too much more off of both our faces on this one and then these ones are a little bigger too but they all they all end up fitting I, the only paper I ended up using from the Echo Park collection is this floral. Otherwise, this strip um, was from, I want to say the Cartabella. This is Cartabella, and it's two pieces put together, and this is Cartabella. Um, I mismeasured, and all my papers are different sizes, but that's whatever. It's fine. So... It's going to be a white cardstock on a cream, but I really like the way that turned out. So now I just need to glue things down and um, pick out some more letters. I'm going to have fall, it's going to say fall selfies. Uh, so I need to find some alphas to be my word selfie. And I'm not really sure what color to use to make sure it stands out. So I might have to play with it a little bit. So let me get all this stuff glued down and then I will be back with that title and we'll just wrap this page up since I did do this one a little late. Oh, pfft. I just realized I spelled it wrong. <laughs> I forgot the H. Um, yep, that's my day. <laughs> We're gonna peel these up and just move them over. So I decided to go with this Aqua from Simple Stories because I've got some kind of aqua-y blues and it really stands out, so it's the selfies. There we go, fall selfies. Added some other stickers in some of the clusters. But I really like the way this um, this side goes with this side. So these will be next to each other, side by side, in the album. And they go really well together. So just this addition of this paper and this. Otherwise, everything else was from that collection uh, by Cartabella. So 
not too shabby looking pretty good really busy lots of color but thank you guys so much for watching um check out dusty attic sketches please on their instagram it'll be linked down below um as well as uh the scrap room where i got these kits from so thank you very much we'll see you next time